Governments going on about youths and gangs, media drawing blood with their fangs. This isn't an episode of Twilight, innocent peeps being killed in daylight. This country is in a state of unrest. Governments say they're doing their best. Best to make the richer richer and paint the poor out of the picture. Cameron says he's not gonna micromanage the city, but keeps depleting the needy's kitty. Spending money on war on nuclear weapons. Armed oh, police on our street is threatened. It's all about an eye for an eye. Everyone's hungry for a bigger piece of the pie. With this hunger, mistakes are made. War is profitable and debts get paid. The first casualty of war is truth. Oil was the reason, but there's no proof. All I hear is the same old line. And they wonder why they're doing time. You don't know I stood and robbed to survive. Nah. You just didn't get an education. You just scabbed. You don't know what survival means. Feeding a family of five on a tin of beans. Survival is against all odds. People praying to their gods. Survival is a matter of life or death. No benefits, no education, no NHS. The gangs and the government. Two opposing factors. All about land, driving around on their tractors. Both believe in get rich or die trying, leaving loved ones at home crying. Soldiers being shot for what? Youths being shot for rock. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Which country to invade has the most dough? In Afghanistan for security measures. It's a good spin, whilst it's two for one on little red treasures. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Next man disrespected man killing me's a foe! Oh, man disrespected man cause he got your trainers! You disrespected life, bruv, that's a no-brainer! You'll get life, bruv, cause of our pair of trainers! <laughs> There's a fine line between love and hate. Warring with your enemy and calling them your mate. You're in a glass house, so put down that stone. Your halo slipped and you ain't got a throne. Governments lead and we are meant to follow. It's tricky when their actions are hard to swallow. I get it, you had a shit life, don't give a damn. Leave the past behind and start behaving like a man. You're two of a kind, opposite camps, but with a like mind. Your loves are pretty much the same. Power, money and guns. What a shame. You two could learn a lot from each other. All well talked about a big brother. Public mind control and perpetual war. It's hard to think he was talking about 1984.